Hello everyone, welcome to SFDC Commando. Today we are gonna see how we can create a UI where we have the UI for the any record creation and the same time we want to attach any file. So here is the one of my use case. Suppose I'm in a, like account record, yeah, and we have the case record to be created. So if you click here like case creation here you can see first you have to create the case and we have the option to attach the file now we have the requirement or the business case saying that okay as and when we create the same ui we have to also allow user to upload any file or multiple file so now how we can do that definitely uh, with the customization of the lightning web component or lightning we can definitely we can do that however uh, we have another capability to do in the same manner but not with using customization we can use flow so without wasting much time let's jump into our session working session how we can do using flow so here uh, i'm in flow and we have the option called create new so i'll be creating new flow for the same requirement yeah so I'm going to select the screen flow. So once you select the screen flow, you'll be landed to this screen. Yeah. So next, what you have to do here is click on this plus sign and say we need a screen here. There we have to drag all the mandatory field what we need to be created for a case. So for example, we need a subject. So subject is like text type. So drag one field another field we need for okay first let's give the name so i'll say subject here yeah api name will be remain same and this is required i'll not mark anything as default and another field we need as like pick list for status yeah and status we can get it from the case object itself so how we can do that so let's keep the name of this status yeah, status and you can also make this as like required and we'll say text type yeah now we have the option called choice so say new choice resources and here we have to select it from the pick list choice say and uh, here you can see that this choice will come from our object yeah so give the name uh, case status yeah and description keep it empty for now and what we are going to select here is case so we want to get the status value or the pick list value value from case object so what is the type it's a pick list and mention the name of the field status and you are done you can make this a default order of the field and you are done yeah so this is what you have to do and if you want to make anything any value as a uh, default definitely we want as new so say yes new and uh, we can drag another field called uh, text area where is long text area for the description yeah so say description yeah Just type o. okay description i'll keep the same uh, not mandatory okay leave it now another uh, required field we need as like account because the our case use cases for the account yeah uh, so i'll be using lookup here where is the lookup yeah so i can keep it at the top yeah give the name api name saying that uh, account yeah we can also say account id give the account object is the like lookup account okay and the record value what we can get it from here is uh, we have to create a, a new variable so you can select the variable this would be like we'll be getting from the our lightning component or not lightning component 
lightning record page uh, from there we we are going to set the our account id so for that reason i'm creating the variable here so you can say account id yeah data type be text and say input so as in you mark this as input this will be exposed to our lightning record page where we can set the value so say you are done now okay object api name not valid okay let's okay account lookup yeah so we need the our record id okay so once we are done uh, is it mandatory yes this is mandatory we have to say true and we are done for this screen and uh, just set the footer what we need from the footer we don't need pause button and previous so hide it yeah so pause hidden you are okay so we have not given the name here so this is for the new case yeah and say done so once you mark this one as done what you have to do here is go to the plus sign and add the our create records action because whatever the value we are going to input on the screen same we want to insert into our case record so you just mention that create case yeah one record we want yes so okay what object we want we want to be inserted in case yeah then here we have to do the mapping field mapping with our on screen variable whatever just now we have created so field is account id yes what we want to set we want to set our screen so here you can see the screen components so screen component you can see yeah so id record id we want to set on this now next what you want to set you want to set the uh, subject of this so subject here you can see the screen so this is our subject what else we need we need status yes we have the status then select the same here status on the screen yeah next we are setting up the description 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 yeah i think four values we have so four only we did so once you are done yeah say then once you are done with these two steps next step what you have to do here is click on the plus in next screen very next screen we have to allow user to select the file which we want to attach with this case so here we have the option called uh, so what to say yeah so file upload so we have option called file upload just drag this yeah once you drag you have to give the api name upload upload a file yeah and i can give the name upload uh, upload file yes and uh, you can mention what format and all but for now i'm allowing all the format next uh, that is very much important is we have to assign the related record id so whatever the case has been created that id we have to give here so how we can get that so if you see here we'll get the name of our flow where is that yeah case id from create a case so whatever i mean previous screen uh, where we are creating not previous screen previous flow we are creating the case so we want this id so we'll get it once you are done say done so we'll get there because we have not given the name of it so i'll just give upload upload 
file okay and we have to configure this footer we don't need pause button here okay say done so once you are done we want to show the success message so what we can do just screen okay success message okay just drag this display text and say message and then give some successful message your case has been created successfully and file also has been attached yeah and you can say you are dead or next is the configure your footer we you don't need this hide you don't need previous yeah once you're there we need this say dead now next is just save this so create a new case and you can give any description for now i'm just skipping this yep so once you are done just activate this flow yeah so what you have to do next here is just go to the same account page where you have opened the record and go to the lightning record page that is called edit page now once click here you will be navigate to our lightning record page edit mode there i will be dragging one field a uh, property called flow into this area okay okay so that we can notice what is there yeah so create a case no we want create new case okay if you see uh, whatever the variable we have created as input we are getting this so what we want we want to set this as record dot id so if you are working on different uh, record and we have the lookup relation with account then we can keep the record dot whatever the api name of that account field it will work and after that you can save and it is safe just go back let's see the ui how that ui is look like yeah so here we have the option so so look like uh, i did some mistake here on the flow so let me go back to flow uh, and see what mistake we have done yeah so okay case sensitive so this one i just take it wrong so now we have to give the our account name uh, inside the case object what is the field name of that so it is account id and what label we want to keep and the object api from where we want to get this particular account field so of course from the case object so now i have corrected this and done so once i just save uh, i have to just save as so it will get into like another version of the flow and next would be activate now let's go back to our account and refresh the page and see whether this issue is resolved or not yeah so here we go so here you can see by default the account name is coming on this field as we have passed the record id on this particular flow uh however if you want to change you can do that you want to create for another account definitely you can do that you have to do so let's give a taste our flow case trial and say status as demo and say next so next screen would be our uh, file selection where we have to select our file so let's select this and say next yeah so once it is done 
uh, we'll go to the next screen so it's still loading yeah so this is done now click on the next so next screen would be our success message yeah so here you can see your case has been created successfully and file also has been attached once you are done you can say finish so once we have created now go back to the our related list of this account and see uh, to verify basically whether this has been created or not yeah here we go so this is my case which i have created yeah can we see the file uh, uh, we go to related hope so if not then yeah so here you can see this attachment is here 